Hi everyone, my name is Prithvi from Informatica GCS and today we will talk about how to enable glossary association, relationship discovery and data classification capabilities for few of the scanners which were not supported before November release. These are the few scanners for which glossary association, relationship discovery and data classification are now implemented as a part of November release. ADLS Gen 2, Teradata, SAP, Azure Data Factory, SAP BO, PostgreSQL, SAP HANA DB, and Tableau Server. Now let's look at the demo. Now let's go to the MCC page and open one of the scanners for which we want to enable the capabilities. I am taking ADLS Gen 2 as an example. You can click on the configuration and go to the data classification tab. Here you can enable data classification for ADLS Gen 2. You can choose the generated data classification powered by Claire or you can specify the data classification rules as per your use case. Here click on add data classification. You can select the auto-populated data classifications. Now let's go to relationship discovery. The same can be enabled from this button. You can choose the threshold values and in inference model as per your use case. Let's go to glossary association. Enable the glossary association and you can select the enable auto acceptance and the threshold value as per your use case. Once done, you can save the resource and then you can run as per the capabilities. You can select the capabilities that you want to execute and see the results in data governance and catalog page. Similarly, you can enable the capabilities for the other scanners like Teradata, SAP, etc. You can write us back on support videos and informatica.com or write us on Twitter. Thank you.